Okay, so Dr. Allgood, if you could explain everything you have here and what it's used for. Yeah, so uh, we're going to show you how the pure packets work to make water safe to drink. I'll start the process right away. Uh, we have here dirty water. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, there's way too much dirty water uh, in, the, in the world. Uh, about 800 million people don't have access to safe drinking water. That's right. one of the, the key Millennium Development Goals. And so P&G worked with the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention to develop these, these pure packets. And they're a simple way to take extremely contaminated water and make it clear, clean, and purified right. so that it's potable for consumption, so it's safe to drink. So what, what is in that? The ingredients that are in, in the pure packet are the same ingredients that are used in municipal water treatment. And if you think about it, that's, that's pretty cool because everybody deserves clean drinking water. Uh, and this is a way for people in far rural villages in Haiti or Malawi to have access to the same water that we have uh, and quickly because these packets are easy to ship uh, anywhere in the world and easy to train people on, on how to use them. Uh, so it's the same exact ingredients that are used in municipal water treatment and have been used for generations. It's the reason we no longer have cholera outbreaks in the U.S. and we used to. But unfortunately cholera is rampant in many parts of Africa now and other countries including Pakistan. Okay, so you just pour it in and stir? Yeah, and so the way it works is you add one packet to 10 liters. We're doing a little bit less here, so you can see, so I didn't add all the packet. Uh, and you stir for uh, five minutes. Mm -hmm. You let the water settle. It'll become clear. And then you pour it through a simple cotton cloth. You wait 20 minutes, and then the water's safe to drink. So wow. even heavily contaminated water becomes clear and, and clean and, and ready, ready to drink. So people have been using this around the world? Like yeah. So far, uh, PNG Children's Safe Drinking Water Program and our partners have provided enough of the pure packets to treat 2.4 billion liters of clean drinking water. Wow. 2.4 bi billion liters. We know where the product goes, mm -hmm. and the World Health Organization has data on illness and death rates in the different countries, different regions. And so we can estimate that the 2.4 billion liters have prevented more than 100 million days of illness and saved more than 13,000 lives. Wow. So, uh, and it's all because of partnerships that we form. More than 100 partners, World Vision, PSI, CARE, Save the Children, many local NGOs in different countries. Those are the people that are the groups that are on the ground pro providing the packets. So do you get money back from doing this or where does the money come from and go to? How does it all work? P&G, uh, through our P&G Foundation and also through some of our brands, contributes to the program. Okay. And we have other partners that are, are providing funds to the program, some of our partners are funding. What we found is that uh, safe drinking water is cross-cutting across the Millennium Development Goals. And you can make other development efforts work better if you provide safe drinking water. Right. For example, the CDC has measured that providing the pure packets and hand washing in schools reduce school absenteeism by one-third. Uh, a recently published study showed that it was sustainable and it reduced school absenteeism and that's a great way to break the poverty cycle by keeping kids in school. Okay, so what are your future plans for this? Is, are there going to be more available? Or? Well, um, our, there's a couple things that are our future plans. One is that PNG is committed to save one life every hour by scaling up the PNG Children's Safe Drinking Water Program. This means more efforts to raise awareness. Uh, we're going to build a new manufacturing plant so we can make enough of the pure packets to, to do that. Um, and then we'll scale it up. Uh, also, some of our PNG brands now are getting behind the calls. Uh, we have a skincare brand in Asia okay. uh, that Kate Blanchett is supporting. It's called SK2. They just launched the, Scare for, the uh, Clear for Life Foundation. CoverGirl here in the US, it's a PNG brand. Two of our CoverGirls, Queen Latifah and Donny Ramirez, have been behind uh, CoverGirl Clean Makeup for Clean Water campaign. Uh, and finally, Pantene, uh, the largest hair care brand in the world, has just launched, launched a, a campaign called Healthy Hair for Healthy Water. And all of these are raising funds so that we can provide more clean drinking water. And we want people to think about contributing to clean drinking water. Right. And so uh, efforts um, to, to raise funds to contribute to csdw.org. Every dollar that's provided will provide water to a child for 50 days. Okay. So we've been stirring for about five minutes now. Right. And you can begin to see the particles come yeah. together. The, the ingredients in Pure sort of work like a dirt magnet. It pulls the dirt, the worms, and the parasites out of the water okay. so they can fall to the bottom. And then it has a disinfectant in it so it kills 
the bacteria and viruses that cause cholera and dysentery and typhoid fever. Okay. So it purifies the water quickly. Right. And what, one of the great things about this uh, technology that we developed with the CDC is that it provides such a strong visual impact. So even if someone doesn't have a lot of education, if they take their water and they add this back in and yeah. it gets clear, they believe it works because they can see it with their own eyes. Right. So what's the next step after this? We let it settle for a few minutes and then we'll pour it through a cloth. Uh, really any cotton cloth works. There's nothing special about the cloth. And it's just really to uh, help decant the water so none, none of the wow. particles have to be floating uh, yeah, in the water. Yeah, you can see it all separated. One of the things that we announced today is a, a partnership to help people in Pakistan. Okay. You know, the, the floods in Pakistan have impacted more than 20 million people. And one of the very uh, top priorities is clean drinking water. Right. The, the normal water supplies that aren't, weren't very good in some places already are, are ferocious now. People are drinking out of, of streams, they're drinking, having to drink the flood water that's highly contaminated. And unfortunately, disease outbreaks are already occurring. Now, for the Southeast Asia tsunami, for Haiti, the international community did a really good job of preventing the second wave of death that occurs from unsafe drinking water in these emergencies. We're not doing that in Pakistan. There is a second wave of death that's occurring right now because so many people are, are dying, so many children are dying from unsafe drinking water. So PMG and our Children's Safe Drinking Water Program have combined forces with the United States Agency for International Development and the U.S. State Department to have an effort that's going to provide clean drinking water with the pure packets to more than a million and a half people. We're going to provide more than a quarter of a billion liters of clean drinking water. Uh, and we're really, we're really grateful to USAID and, and, and the U.S. State Department. The U.S. State Department is using funds that Americans contributed yeah. through the Pakistan Relief Fund, and those are the funds that are going to go to help provide pure, provide the right utensils, and importantly, make sure that people understand how to use the product correctly. So do you see a day where everyone around the world really could just have access to clean drinking water? Certainly, everyone deserves and needs to have access to, to clean drinking water. There's, there's no other uh, foreseeable future that, that's right. Uh, everyone needs to have clean drinking water through a variety of ways to do it. Hopefully everybody will have pipe treated water coming out of their faucets someday. Right. That's not a reality now. Right now 4,000 children die every day from unsafe drinking water. So we need a variety of tools to enable people uh, to clean the drinking water now and, and save lives. And the last step is to filter. Okay. So we've, we stirred for five minutes, Yeah. and maybe you can hold the uh, cloth. We can. Moment. Thank you very much. And then we pour through this cloth, and then we wait 20 minutes and the water is fully safe to drink. And then you can just go right ahead and drink that? Yep. It's, uh, it's really a simple process that we've measured people know how to do correctly when they get a little bit of training. Wow. So you can see that we have clean drinking water. Cheers. <laughs> it's a healthy water. <laughs> it's a healthy water. <laughs>